Hi, I'm Annie B. Parson and I'm Paul Lazar. And we're the co-directors of Big Dance Theater. We're bringing Supernatural Wife to your theater, The Walker, in November. The last piece we brought was to the Southern Theater, and this will be our first presentation in the new theater. Uh, Supernatural Wife is a um, <clears throat> an adaptation of a play by Euripides uh, called Alcestis, because uh, Alcestis is the protagonist. Alcestis is um, a queen whose husband is dying, but they make a deal with the gods. The husband, the king, can save his life, can live. He just has one problem. He has to find someone who will die in his place, will die for him. And uh, nobody's willing to do it except his wife, the queen. Uh, this is a 2,500-year-old story still extremely resonant and uh, a, a, a rich adventure into the, the ideas around grief and autonomy and marriage and it's, it's endlessly rich. But we're just as interested stylistically in how you present a story now as um, we are in the plot itself. We're, our company is primarily a dance company. We use about 50% of the text and the text is translated by Ann Carson. And uh, Ann Carson, when she um, spoke to us about us uh, using her uh, uh, translation, she's a great scholar and a great poet in her own right, we were nervous that she would not be uh, receptive to the idea of the text being um, cut and it being replaced by dances. But when we proposed this to Ann Carson, her response without any prompting from us was take out the text and put in dances. So Ann as a scholar I think understands how deeply integrated movement and singing um, were in the Greek plays. And I think that's why our company in particular uh, tapped into uh, some feeling of the original plays. I'm not quite 2,500, so I don't know exactly what it was like then, but this has a, 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 a scent of authenticity to it in my bones. Um, we're going to say goodbye, but um, we really look forward to seeing, um, to bringing this production to Minneapolis.